Hi everyone, welcome to Moff.ai. This is Pratik and I'm here to walk you through how you can set up your WhatsApp business account using Moff.ai. I'll also take you through some key steps uh, on the platform, some uh, primary features of the platform that will help you understand how you will be able to customize your use cases on Moff.ai. Right, so let's get started. Um, let's begin with clearing some of your confusions on what a WhatsApp business account is. Right, so typically you use a, a mobile app for using WhatsApp and talking to your friends and family. If you are a small business, you might have also used WhatsApp business mobile app, which is another mobile app, but uh, for small businesses. What we are talking about here, it's different. It's none of these, it's WhatsApp business account. Right? And through that, you get access to WhatsApp API. Now, when you have APIs, uh, that can help you do uh, a lot of things which we will talk about uh, as you know. Right? So, uh, you might be a fintech company that needs to, let's say, send notification or transaction alerts to your users, or you might be a healthcare startup trying to take uh, orders for medicine, let's say, or, or, uh, or you're a local business giving household services and you want your users to book your appointment. So, anything, any e com, agri tech, IT services, any industry you come from, or any use case that you might have, like manual customer support or customer support automation, or sending notifications, or selling products on whatsapp or with lead generation they were marketing right or you might just want to automate any process like your uh, hr onboarding or anything in turn right so moff.ai is a single platform that can help you achieve uh, any of these easily let me quickly show you what moff.ai platform looks like right so you would start from our website and you would uh, click on start building and sign up and once you sign up you log in uh, into the account and what you see is you're getting a 21 day free trial once you go through this and you just uh, go ahead on the platform you will find a lot of help to take you through the process so you can read about the basics of uh, what a whatsapp business account is here are some of the key concepts two of these i want to take you through very quickly first any number that you're using for a whatsapp business account cannot be used on a mobile app if you are currently using it on a mobile app, you'll need to deactivate it and you'll not be able to use that same number on a WhatsApp mobile app later on. Secondly, it's very important to know about message types. There are two kinds of messages in WhatsApp, replies and notifications. So if a user messages you on WhatsApp, you have 24 hours to respond to that user and that response would be counted as a session message. But if you want to initiate as a business, uh, initiate a chat from your end, for that you'll need to send a pre-approved notification or a templated message that you would need to send to your users. And these messages are manually approved by the team of WhatsApp. Also, you need to have an explicit opt-in from your user to be able to send the notification to that particular user. For more details on this topic or API limits and other uh, such things, you can go to the help links in each of these subsections or you can quickly go to the question mark icon here and uh, browse through the guides and tutorials to get help on what you need. If you need a discussion, you can create a ticket for our team or you can chat with our support team and resolve your queries. The next important thing is sandbox. So Sandbox is a part of your trial account. Remember when you signed up, you saw 21 days trial period. Uh, any remaining number of days is visible here in the bottom. And using Sandbox, you can use that trial period to create your application or create some tests so that can make you understand how WhatsApp and Moff.ai's ecosystem work. So all you need to do is scan this QR code from your mobile camera and you will be able to see a message pre-written, just send that and the bot will respond to you. And once the bot has responded, now you can come back to the platform and customize the responses of the bot. Before we move to customizations, you need to think about what you're building. So when you're formalizing your thoughts around what you want to build, try to segment them into three, three categories. So either you want to automate a process on WhatsApp or you might send notifications to your end users or you might just want to have one-on-one -on -one chats because you might have 5, 10, 50 customer support agents or sales agents 
so your requirement might map to either of these three categories or a combination of these three categories so try, try to think in that format while you are setting up your use case you should also start the application for whatsapp so you come to apply for whatsapp and just fill up these details here again in, in, if you need any help with any of these details you can refer to the help links and help text below or you can certainly come to our guides and tutorials or chat section so when you proceed with this application the system would ask you for a pricing plan and you'll need to add a credit card to take the application ahead before we get started into changing the chat flow and uh, designing our system, I would like to tell you a couple of things. So the coolest thing about Moff.ai is that uh, the platform gives you an ability to set up your use case on your own. Right? You don't need to rely on any external team or custom setup uh, to you know just build what you want and keep editing it as many times as you want. Right? That is the key uh, strength of the platform, which I'll show you in the sections. Uh, uh, right after this but uh, this is to let you know that our team is also available for help right so based on your pricing plan you would get access to uh, custom training calls from our team where, where our team will just uh, get on a, a video call and train you onto the platform right so that will certainly help you get started even if that does not work for you you are a company that uh, wants our team to build the setup for you that is also possible and you can just create a ticket for that right here and uh, somebody from our uh, custom setup team will come back to you and help you with that. Either of the ways, uh, let's move ahead with the rest of the platform and I'll show you how different features can be used to, to help you make the best use of your WhatsApp business account. We begin at the chat flow section. Uh, in the chat flow, you can see a list of conversations here. A conversation is essentially where you store the logic of your chat that you want to have with your customers. So you can create messages, you can create the ways in which the responses of the messages should be validated and what should be done if this succeed or fail and create branches and all kinds of things that you might want to create a automated or semi-automated chat. As you see, there is a REST API block that helps you connect with the external world. Uh, also, you have uh, the option of writing custom code in case you really want to dig something up. The other important sections on the platform are as audience. In audience section, you can see the chat history of all the people that have interacted with your bot and open any any chat from a person and you can see the chat history. You can also see the basic profile details about the person depending on what information the bot is collecting from the person. You can certainly also create custom properties to store any kind of data uh, in the customer's uh, profile. Right? Uh, moreover, you can based on the profile data that you have saved, you can add filters and do segmentations and all kinds of uh, activities uh, which a typical CRM would let you do. Right? So this is audience section is like a built-in CRM that helps you manage your users better. On the segments that you create, you can do different kind of uh, activities later on depending on what your business requirement is. Next, there is Converse. Converse helps you chat with your users manually. This is where your customer support agents or sales agents would sit and manually talk to the waiting users, right? And there is a concept of assignment to individual agents. You might have 5, 10, 20 agents. Then you certainly have the analyze screen where you can see the analytics and nurture screen. You will be able to send broadcast messages or send notifications to your end users. All the details are here. Everything that you would need to set up your use case is available on the platform. Ready to use out of the box. Getting to the final part, uh, which is pricing. So you can explore our pricing uh, details on our website or in the platform uh, once you move ahead with your WhatsApp business application. So Moff.ai is partnered with the most popular API providers across the globe and that helps us provide suitable pricing options to uh, businesses that have, might have as low as 500 users a month to uh, 5,000, 50,000 or 5 million users a month, right? So. When you choose Moff.ai, the key thing to understand is that you, you're saving a lot of money because you have all these features ready to use, right? You don't have to pay uh, someone else to build those for you or build a bot for you or to integrate any APIs, right? Everything is right here available for your use um, without any additional cost besides uh, obviously your pricing plan that you've picked up. Also, if you, if you do a cost analysis with that in your mind, uh, Moff.ai typically proves to be three to four times cheaper than other options in the market. And 
that's that's what we're doing so we're here to make your whatsapp business process easy simple and give all the power in your hands to be able to build what you want and and have great interactions with your audience on whatsapp so all the best and hope to see you guys doing amazing things soon bye bye